we'd like to talk to you about the I-6300 electronic throttle and shift system. It's being brought into the marketplace so that the boater has a automotive look, feel, and experience when he's operating his boat. People want to buy a boat, they want it to be hassle-free, they want it to have quality, and above all, they want it to operate and feel just as if they were driving their SUV or if they were driving their car. Regardless of whether the weather conditions are throwing the boat around, if there's a lot of traffic in the area, if you have to dock the boat, with this electronic throttle and shift system, you'll feel like you're always in control and you won't have any unexpected experiences. What I'd like to do is just give you a quick overview of the operation of the control head. It has two levers because we've got twin engines, twin transmissions, in this case stern drives. It's got tilt and trim on the left lever. We've really taken to heart what the boater's needs and wants are. To begin with, you've got four screws, two for each one of the handles on this control head. One of the screws allows you to set the pressure for the throttle. The other one allows you to set the detent pressure. That simply means you can change the amount of pressure going in and out of gear. So if you're in heavy seas or if you're in a high speed boat, you can actually change the, the feel of this control head to match your comfort levels. Some people like zero pressure, other people, as I said, like to have the system feel more like a traditional cable controlled system. Then some of the other features on this control head give you the ability to do uh, a idle engine warm up by means of depressing either one of these two neutral buttons simply allows you to warm up the engines without engaging the transmission or the stern drives. Down below you've got select, this is station select. If you have multiple stations on the boat, you can depress the select key. It allows you to transfer control of the control head to the upper station or from the upper station down to the lower station. The other feature that I'd like to talk about on this control head is the sync function. This allows you as the boat owner and operator to use just one lever to control multiple engines, transmissions, stern drives. To use the system all you do is have the levers matched up, push the sync button, you'll see the red light comes on. Now I can drop back one lever and as you can see the boat continues to operate as it was with just this lever in charge or in control. So it doesn't matter whether I've got two, three, four engines, this sync function allows me then to cruise all day, have my engines in perfect match without having to look at the RPMs and move the levers back and forth and constantly having that hassle. I'm going to go ahead and put it back take it out of sync, just move the two levers together, make sure they're within 10% of each other, push the sync button, and you're out of sync. So it's just that easy to use. The advantage of having a sync function is that you can sit and have the engines in total harmony and balance without having to look at the tax. So you don't have to worry about looking up at your gauges all the time. You can actually cruise and enjoy the afternoon and enjoy your time with your family on the boat. Another feature of this control head is split range throttle. It gives you the ability to program in up to 25% of the engine's capability with full lever movement. So what you've got is a lot of resolution. It allows you to tune the engine speed based on what your particular needs are. Another feature that you want to um, keep in mind is, is that you've got a um, in-gear start protection system. This system will not allow the engines to start if the levers aren't in neutral. So when you look at all of the different features that we've programmed into this, it gives you a lot of versatility, a lot of capabilities, and it's all based on your individual needs as a boater.